Familiar? Have we met before? Ah, Vulkalgard, of course. Welcome to Tanzelville. Perhaps you will get through to Her Majesty where we could not. Queen's favorite. I'm glad you're here. We came to Tanzelville to honor the spirits of our ancestors, and now they seem bloody well determined to kill us all. An excellent question, for which I have no answer. My dear sister, your queen, brought us here to perform a ceremonial ritual. It's a bit of political theater, really. Gain the blessings of the dead and all that rubbish. If danger doesn't find her, she'll seek it out and invite it home to dinner. She's in the ruins just ahead, conspiring with the battle reeve. They're determined to complete the ceremony. Do be a loyal subject and see that she survives, won't you? I swear, it's like being home for a new life festival. The family's been drinking since noon, and everyone wants you dead. Oh, you know how it is. In the waters off the island, there are great sea beasts. Smaller creatures cling to their sides, eating the scraps they leave behind. It's just the same with nobility on land. Tradition. Whenever a new monarch takes the throne, there are endless rituals and ceremonies. I myself was more than halfway through the 88 days of liturgical chanting required to take the throne. Then my dear sister returned. Oh yes, when our father, King Hiddelith, may he reign in glory, passed away, she was slated to begin the ceremonies. But then she left, just poof, gone, before she even entered the sappy ark's labyrinth. Just so. And so it fell to me to spend the requisite 3,555 days studying Alt Mary custom and ceremoniarchy. Oh, but I digress. Oh, you know how it is. Yeah! We call upon our honored ancestors to pass on their memory and wisdom. Your ancestors disavow you, false one. The Veiled Queen is the rightful heir, and Norian shall My queen, end your reign. Look out! The Queen's safety is my primary concern. Well, that could have gone better. Maybe it's all that royal we nonsense. We call upon our ancestors. It's all rather condescending, isn't it? Don't remind me. This ceremony is supposed to show Oridon that I honor our people's culture and heritage. 
It's supposed to show that our ancestors see me as the rightful heir. I guess our ancestors have ideas of their own. I don't know. It mentioned Norian, my advisor. You met him in Volkilgard, I believe. My friend, something has gone wrong here. I hate to ask your aid again, but I must. There are two priestesses elsewhere in the ruins, women I trust. If Norian has turned against me, I fear for their lives. Stand with them as they perform their parts of the ceremony. Keep them safe. These ceremonies are important to my people, which makes them important to me, I guess. Continue the rituals, of course. The priestesses are waiting on me. No unquiet dead will keep me from finishing what I began here. It's as I said, the ceremonies are for the people. They've always been a part of crowning a new Alt Mary monarch. The people are already nervous about my extended absence. They need to know they can trust me. I've no idea who the Veiled Queen might be. Perhaps the leader of that Veiled Heritance group? And in my estimation, Norian would sell his own mother if he thought he'd get a good price at the market. Norian was a staunch supporter of my father, and after him, Naaman's bid for rule. He was very vocal in his disappointment when I returned and took the crown. For Norion, it's all a power game, and I wasn't playing his way. Just so. I had hoped Astania led some kind of small splinter group, or gave a grandiose name to a group of thugs. If they can strike at us here through Norion, they're a viable threat. Continue the rituals, of course. The priestess... It must be Norian. Thrice. May the ancestors bless you. The ritual is complete. You may go.
Did you see her? She tried to kill me. Colin Way is an ancestral spirit that haunts this grove. She's always been a mischievous one, but I've never seen her so violent. She's lying in wait, ready to pounce as soon as I lower my defenses. I can't complete the Queen's ceremony unless you banish her from this plane. Be careful. She'll tear your throat out if you give her half the chance. The ancients bless you for your prayers. My friend returns. Are the rituals completed? Are the priestesses safe? That's a relief. Thank you. Now comes the tricky bit. The final ritual must take place inside the ancestral tombs, where, I would imagine, the most powerful dead dwell. If I am to be queen, I must look fear in the face and conquer it. How can I ask my people to have faith in me if I don't have faith in myself? I was a warrior before I became queen. I can handle myself. But you're determined, and I know you're foolhardy enough. I would welcome your company. I can handle myself. I was a warrior long before I became a queen. Your Majesty, let me come with you. 
I should warn you. Three coins say Norian is down in the crypts. Well, no. But to control these spirits so completely, he'd have to be close. The crypt is a winding complex with plenty of places for quiet spellcasting. I'm prepared for anything. If he's sided with this veiled queen, he's a traitor. That means we end him, here and now. You are no fool, my friend. You are a spoiled child. Give up this charade and let the Veiled Queen lead off. Don't want to stay down here any longer than we have to. Watch yourself. I'm glad you're down here, my friend. The ancestors have forsaken you. Things I endure for my people. Foolish girl! Our people will never name you that queen. Destroy that crystal over there. I'll take out the crystal by the door. Time to destroy this crystal and move on. The Veiled Queen will lead us. I feel the ancestors guiding me. Let's keep moving. Why struggle, I read? This can only end one way. My sword is thirsty. Beyond this door lies the Ancestral Chamber at the very heart of Tenzelwa. If I complete the ritual and receive the Ancestor's blessing, the people will finally accept me as King Tamlin's heir. I serve the Veiled Queen. 
Your people! True Ortona, do not consort with savages and beasts. Ancestors bless us with their wisdom and protection. The ancestors honor your prayers. May the light of the eight bless you and guide you. Let your reign be long and peaceful. It's finished. Let's get out of this dark place. Follow me. You risked everything to help me. I won't forget it. You're too modest. Thank you, my brave and noble friend. Until we meet again, wherever the road may take us. Go carefully on the roads, my friend. You're a valuable resource to the Dominion. And me, of course. Of course, my friend. Our little adventure here has brought up a few questions of my own. Worried about them turning like Norian? I don't believe so. Norian was old guard and never very fond of me. Most of the others awaiting us on the road honestly want change. Outright traitors like Norian we end, no question. The problem is that traitors like Norian are only fanning the flame. If I can't win over my people, the heretics will be dealing with me instead of the other way round. We have dozens of stops along the road, speaking at farms and holdfasts. My next big event is in Skywatch, I believe. They're throwing a festival, and I'm to make a public appearance with my sister-in-law, Estri. Always thrilling. There's no love lost there, no. My brother took the news of my return fairly well, all things considered. I'm not sure his wife has it in her to be as forgiving. She wanted to be queen. One day. Over a drink, you must tell me what happened down there. For now, the Queen's safety is my primary concern. Razum Dar has been investigating threads in the Veiled Heritance plot. We think he's caught a break in Matisson, and he could use some help. Head up there and lend him a hand, will you? <laughs> 